Hey guys, alright, today I'm gonna show you how to use the basic of green screen without using the knob. You can actually do it all in Blender VSE. So, let's, let's get with the basic idea. Okay. You can create a... Uh, Okay, the idea is that anything on the black side, you won't be able to see. Anything on the white side, you will see. So let me let me give you an idea. You can also create shapes, you know, or even letters, say, okay. I think this should be good enough. All right, let's take this. Alright, now you create the black and white. This is just example for now. I just want to give you the idea, anything that's black, you cannot see. Anything that's white, you can see. And you can utilize this by using a mask. So let's go to Blender here. Let's add a video. Um, add this video. Okay, check out the sound. Okay, imagine this is green screen. I will show you with the green screen later. So why not give you an example what I mean by using a mask? You just go to this video here, okay? You can... Actually, you first add... Right. I'll show you each one. Pretty much cutting it. To break it down. So for this one, let's just say I want to ask mass number one. This is considered mass. Okay, so let's just hide them all. Okay. So you have one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Okay. I hide them all so you can pretty much don't see them. You can put them anywhere. Doesn't matter. But anyway, you go to here. You go down to your modifier strip. Okay. You add a mass. All right. On the strip, you simply select one. There you go. See, half of it, it's gone. Well, you can also... Yeah, half of it's gone. You see, you could add something else here, if you like. You know, this is the black side, remember I just cut off, and this is the white side. All you have to do is go here. Okay, uh, let me see if I can move this around. Anyway, let's go to the second one, which is this one. As you can see, uh, let me bring it out. This is, our, this is our mask. This is black, and this is white. So you hide this. Okay, so let's apply it to this, this segment here. All you have to do, like you did earlier, go to mask. Instead of mask, normally I show you guys how you create a mask in the previous video, but for this time, just use strip. Strip is pretty much, you know, it's always black and white, so you see, now you see it cut off right here. Let's go to the third one. And strip three. Uh, let's go to the fourth one. And let's go to the last one. See, completely blank out. And this one is the one that I created with a shape. So, let's go mass. There you see, you see this? It, it actually, it's, it's, when you play the video, you know this is playing with the, you know, on the mask that you created. Cool, isn't it? Yeah. 
Now, you can also... Let me see if I could blend them together. Okay, like the video. To create an animation. Right? So, let, let me see if I could blend them together. All I have to do is just go up. The channel. Now, let's, let's separate by each channel. The reason why I do that is because... Okay, here you have separate. So this, all you have to do is stand it a little bit. Okay. Because you already apply the mask, but you want to make it a, a smooth transition. So, right click, hold shift, right click on this, add, grab across, and then right click, do the same thing. Same thing. Simple transition. Okay, now we have a transition. You see how the corner box fade, and then and that come out, and then and go back to normal again. You see, you can also do transition like that to animate your the, the box you want to close out. Not only that, this part right here is pretty much um, open to anything. So, for instance, you can also add another video or an image if you want. Let me show you by example. Uh, let's I go with food. Okay, let's just say I go with the... Uh, which one I like? The machine. The scoop, the scallop. Make the scallop look cool. Alright, see so I have this food here. Let's see how this. Okay, let's get down. Okay, let's get down. Alright, let's just move it. Let's just scan it all the way. With a very short clip, but I just want to do that. Right, sit. Just blank out. Uh, let me just go by hard cut. This is an example. You can put any video. I just want to show you. you know. Okay. So I'm going to stand this. Alright. So I want to fill the. All you have to do is just go out for under. Yeah, now you have a. Now you have. And you can start to see the food. That's cool, huh? Alright, so let's just make it more. You could, you know, you, you let's just say you don't like it see here. Instead of showing it one by one, like a puzzle, you could always move it, you know. Let's go to make offset. Just move it here. Yeah, you can move it right here. So that way it don't get in your way. And then you can do the same thing. But this time right here is blank, you know. But, you know, you, you get like that. You can fill that with. Whatever you want. Mm, you have this too. So green screen is very, uh, pretty much the same principle. Alright, now let me just show you how I do it with the green screen. So I put up this sample video. I didn't even, uh, I don't have a chance to shot it, but for the purpose of this video, I just, uh, bought this video. You could actually get this video here, okay? Just type in green screen sample video, you might be able to find it here. So I'm gonna borrow this video and create how I take out the green screen. You see, it's always good to have good lighting. You see, this is actually a perfect lighting on the back, but you know, you don't really have to. But you can always work your way around it. So let me just put this video right here. So I'll show you what I mean. Uh, add a movie. Okay, here it is. All right, now we have a green screen here. Let's just take off the sound. Let's look at the video, okay. All right, now you have a video here, okay? So what you wanna do, is create a mass for this cube here. See this cube here? You want to create a mass. So you want to change this to white and you want to change this to black. Right? You know. So how can we do this though? First, just like how, what this is? This is just a, a separate layer. Okay? That you can use later. But you just need to mask it out and change it black. You know. So all you have to do is duplicate. Alright? You duplicate this. Um, so you go down to here. Alright, you add. You find it there. Here, and then you need it here. Okay, it's out of my and then you need a curve. Okay, so you have this three here. Okay, so how much for here? You wanna, you wanna lower the, the green. Okay, now you have this black. Try to try to get as black as possible. 
you have this noise here. Uh, this is a challenge. But you have this. But you could, like, uh, you could, uh, lower the value down. That way you get complete. Yeah. You can mess around with it and try to get it perfect as possible. Okay. Okay, that's just for this value here. This is. And then, uh, go down to your. Turn your highlight. So you want this part to be. You want the green to be a little bit. And you want everything to be nothing. If this was color, you know, you just have to saturate that. Put it on this point. Alright, well you have this, yeah. you just play around with it, you know, just try to get it black and white, you know, so when you move, oh, it actually looks weird. Do you like this? How oh, weird. Let's see how it looks like. Yeah, kind of weird. Alright, let's just add a mask shape. Call this the cream. Let's rename this. Go to here. Type in black and white. Okay. Just hide this. Alright, let's see how it looks like. Black and white. Okay, that's what we need. Okay, so. Alright, you're pretty good. Somewhat. Okay, you see it's not perfect, you have to work on the noise here, but you get the idea. You know, just have to know what your subject is. So if this is your subject, you want to make sure this is white, and if this is the, the part that you want to blank out, make sure this is, uh, you know, dark. And to, let's, let's see how it looks like when I put a video over it. Okay, let's see. Go here. Just have to do it, just go alpha over. And now you have a video. But, yeah, you see. There you have it. So, you know, that's how you use the... It's not perfect, but, you know, you can make it perfect. You just need to take some time. Uh, there you go. A basic, basic way you can use uh, black and white. And, and just blocking out the, you know, the white part is where you can see. And then the, the dark part is where you want to just cancel out. Right here, you look a little bit better. On the no, you know, there's stuff like feathers. You can add it. I wonder if you can do it right here. Probably I need to add like a jet layer maybe. But I'll figure it out later. Um, but for now, you know, if you want to do a simple, basic green screen you, on the go, because you know, compositing is it take a take a while. Like you didn't know, it take a while to to just do a basic one. You know, you don't get to put 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 put. put. This one you just pretty much just duplicate, and then and then just try change it to black and white. And then you'll have it white here on the video editing. You know, you don't have to go to the no back and forth. But anyway, I hope this is helpful, and uh, I'll see you guys next time.